Hey guys, Scott here from Service Store. Today we're going to go through some internal rotation strength. This is going to be very important for any type of surfing, paddling, throwing, anything to just kind of get you moving. It's also going to be very helpful with shoulder stability anywhere overhead. A lot of times what you'll see with any internal rotation strength is everything is kind of down here, right at your side. It makes us look like a little T-Rex since this is where we live. We need to get out of that. So big thing is starting to get a little bit more functional or we're going a little bit more overhead. This exercise is going to be really good if we'll stop or we're just going for a little bit of rotator cuff activation. It's going to be a good exercise, but it's not going to carry over very well into actual functioning. Especially if we're up here, we have some changes within our shoulder blade, which changes length and relationship within our rotator cuff muscles. So, in order to maximize strength in that position, what we're going to try and do is get here and go into a little bit of internal rotation. One of the big components with this is I really want shoulder blades to be set down and back. Doesn't mean back, we're really trying to go back. A lot of times what will happen is we'll get back and elevation of our trap will start to activate. It's a nice, big, strong muscle. It'll tend to pull us up and back. That's not what I want. Big thing is trying to get down and back. So we're almost trying to stick out our chest a little bit, really get those shoulder blades down and back to set. That's going to set us up as far as our little rotator cuff muscles to work really well. It's nice and easy, just a little set shoulder blades. Then we're going to add just a little bit of internal rotation going down. Arms kick out a little bit. That's going to be okay. The big thing that I don't want is that we're just doing tricep extension. So if you're coming in, a little rotation and that arm kicks out a little bit, not a big deal. All we're doing is just straightening out that elbow. That's not what I want, that's not the goal. We're really trying to isolate into the internal rotation. Everything feels pretty good. You're able to set those shoulder blades nicely. Then we're just going to work into that internal rotation, trying to get everything working. If you want to change any type of stuff in the shoulder blade, take it easy. Just adjust that shoulder angle either a little bit lower, a little bit higher to try and play with that rotation. Especially if we're up too high and we're not going to have good rotation, if we set down low, 